Hi, good afternoon, John. This is Dylan Spooner from Alderman's Toyota in Rutland, where your satisfaction is our top priority. In front of us here, I am glad to be able to get the opportunity to be able to talk and review the 2023 Toyota GR Corolla, and this is the core trim. For those that are following this car, the Circuit and the Marizo Edition will be available um, a few short months after these, and this is the first one that we've got to see at the dealership. And I'm going to jump right into it here. This is a brand new vehicle in the GR series that's been accompanied now by the GR Supra and the GR86. The GR Corolla, it's powered by a three liter um, turbocharged engine that puts out 300 horsepower and 273 foot pounds of torque, which is also accompanied by a rev matching intelligence manual transmission. And I'll jump into a few more key points about GR, but let's see if you can see it in the white. But you'll see indentation is the new GR4 all-wheel drive system for this car. And to start off, exterior details. You'll see it has the shape and size of the Corolla hatchback, but you'll kind of notice um, some, some GR touches in the front. You'll see right on the right, there's the GR logo and it's kind of surrounded by the serrated honeycomb grille, LED headlights, and fog lights. And you're gonna notice there's some functional vents all over the front grille. You'll see there's a functional grille right on the left. And then also on the top left up here, as well as the other side, is you know, there's some more functional um, air vents right there. And you're gonna see GR heritage all over this car. Has taken a look sharp look at this vehicle. You're gonna notice um, the body lines are quite different versus the Corolla hatchback. You're gonna see it looks like more of a wide bodied vehicle and you can even see all the contours with this being a black vehicle. And then right up front, you're gonna notice there's the sensor out front. So not only is this a performance sports car, but you still get pre-collision system and radar cruise control and a couple other modern amenities that I'm going to go into. The tires on this vehicle, they put Michelin Pilot Sports and it's an 18 inch alloy rim and it's a really nice, it's a really good looking grille um, and the rims, I mean. And then you can see right on the line in the back what I was saying, you see how it kind of bulges out right from the side, which is definitely different from the Corolla hatchback. And you can really see that line go across. This is the first GR vehicle to be able to um, seat five people. And you'll see, let's jump right in at the entry point, you'll see a couple materials being used. And when you sit right in the back, you'll see this seat is all the way just about back. And you'll see they nicely sculpted out the back. So there's plenty of room in the back. And you'll see this is an idea of what it looks like being behind the driver's seat. Leather wrap steering wheel. This one does have the cold weather package. So there's your heated seats. And it is a heated steering wheel. There's your GR shift knob. We'll look at a little bit more up front when we get it there. But with this vehicle, just 60 40 split in the back. And that seat will fold down completely flat. We'll leave that down when we look at the trunk. And taking a look, this keyless entry, and you also get LED turns and a blind spot monitoring system. Jump right in. Put your clutch in, press the GR button. Immediately you'll hear an aggressive exhaust note from that three cylinder. Um, the turbocharger sounds really nice in this vehicle. Um, it's actually, I was surprised to hear that this is more of a throatier engine, um, which is kind of my first response to this. There's the start startup animation because it does have wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. I'll shut this door. And you'll see with the steering wheel, here's the analog to control the cluster up there. And then on this side, radar cruise control, lane departure alert. And then also one of my favorite things is you'll see right down here, you twist it to the left, you see you can change the front and the rear differential, the GR4, you can have the 60-40 split, or you can have the 30-70, which is putting 70% to the rear and 30 in the front, or in this case, my favorite, you can leave it right in track. 
then right down here you have your drive modes so you can do eco normal sport you can even customize your own too so we'll go over that when you get here and then over by my knee there's the heated steering wheel de-icing function automatic high beams and then there's your instrument cluster it's a really comfortable seat and then you also see this has the jbl sound like i said more than enough modern amenities for a practical sports car and then let's just give it one good rev so you can give it a nice listen nice let's shut this off Here's a sharp look of the vehicle right back here. That roof rack accessory is nice. There's, a lot, there's going to be a lot more aftermarket parts that are coming out for the vehicle. <clears throat> and then taking a look right from behind, you'll see kind of has more of a wide body kit to it, has a three exit port exhaust, which gives that lovely exhaust note. And you'll see how this aggressive diffuser, which is good for back force, Nice GR logo right there. You pull this under. And you'll see there's that nice, um, there's the 40 split, there's the 60 split, and it folds down completely flat. And then this tunnel cover comes right off. So if you need more room, and then this one does have the nice GR Corolla cargo tray. And underneath here, you can get a repair kit. You grab one of these handles, really light trunk. You can also notice you cannot see with that tunnel cover down. And then again, here's another sharp look at this vehicle. And yeah, awesome. Really awesome looking vehicle. And again, John, I wanted to thank you very much for watching. This is gonna be an amazing vehicle for us. If you'd like to learn more about it, you may click on the link below. If you're on YouTube, there will be a link in the comment section. Or, of course, you could come see it yourself at Aldi Means Toyota in Rutland.